Hello and welcome, 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 one and all, to part four of this English campaign on Medieval 2 Total War. When we left off, we were marching towards Carnarvon. Rufus was Hail marching towards Carnarvon to take the second settlement. He's taken York. Not something he was particularly that bothered about. It was a, we can go no further, my lord. a small village, and this is slightly yes, more interesting. As you command, my liege. It is a castle, slightly stronger defences. That didn't sound healthy. It sounded like somebody was ejected from something. Oh yeah, and we lost our spy, didn't we? We lost Richard the spy. Yes, very good. And Henry comes of age. And Hubert is born. The family tree is expanding. I mean, let's have a look at it, shall we? Very briefly. We have, uh, obviously, the king in London. Mr. 54-year-old William the Conqueror there. Rufus. Just had a baby. Just got married, actually, as well. And he's actually on the march towards Carnarvon. He's had a busy six months. Very, very busy. Busy nine months, in fact. Unless it was premature. And uh, Robert, married, but no kids yet. We are still holding out a lot of hope. And here he is, the 16 year old Henry, just come of age, waiting for that responsibility. Orders. Yes. Take yourself to Nottingham, keep an eye on the troops while Rufus is away. And. Uh, My liege. By your will, sire, we shall engage. Yes, sire. We shall prevail. Okay. Yes. I love how they just absolutely give you the spiel, man. Right, yes, we're going to build three ladders and a ram. That's about as much as we can build. Oh, four ladders and a ram. Five ladders and a ram. Four ladders and a ram. One, two, three, four. I'll leave one spare unit. I think three and a ram will be suffice. It's only a wooden castle. It's not exactly Fort Knox we're dealing with here. Keeping a keen vigil outside their walls, sire. Okay, so York, we can't build anything else. Nottingham is building something, it's, as is London. Khan could do with being built, uh, being expanded now. Uh, level 3, 3, 3, 2, and 2. Okay, so a stables and a leather tanner. The final two buildings of the second level. And I was considering, uh, well, considering two things first of all. One, Robert. An honour, sire. Go about there. There is no glory in hiding like this, my lord. Yes, my liege. This tower will keep vigil over the lands. Just put a bit of a watchtower there, just to keep an eye on this settlement here and the French from this side. And. Uh, Okay, so this time he managed to make it there and back without being stranded in the middle of nowhere. Probably because we have built some roads since that time passed. And... Rons. I, I am so tempted to take Rons, I tell you. It's uh, so, so close. And Bidelli! Mr. Lawrence Bidelli! He's got a mission! Speak with the Moors! Don't mind if I do. My lord, we are prepared to receive your message, Sadi. Okay, trade rights and map information. I don't mind selling map information to people that I think are just too far away to cause me some concern. Generous. How much is my map information worth to you? I think 700 is suffice. I think that's a reasonable price. Let's do some old, old school bartering, some old school haggling here. I say 800. What do you say, Mr. Nuruddin al Talamanki. Oh, yeah, make offer. The answer, I'm afraid, is no. Ah, okay, 610. I'm going to be that precise, do you? Well, I'm not happy with that, Mr. Al Talamanki. Let's try again, shall we? Let's make it... You know what? Can we, can we type in? Yeah, we can. Let's meet you halfway, mate. 675. 
How about that? There is no honor in forcing <laughs> Stelton's hand like this infidel. Well, you know, you didn't have to accept. I didn't hold a gun to your head. Because they weren't invented at this time, no. I held and bow an arrow to his head. No. And we get... Ah! These council of nobles, these ever so wealthy people that seem to have bucket loads of troops. Yes, sire. Have gifted me with some Stop spearmen. Here, sire. Which I will dutifully use. <laughs> It'd be a shame for them to go to waste. By your command. Leaving the boat, sire. Your will, sire. They can go towards my campaign against Rons. And if I actually highlight Khan here. Oops. And say two more and uh, a horse and an archer. That should be an army strong enough to take Rons. I know I said I'd wait until Carnarvon fell, but why not uh, start the process now? These extra bits of cash that we're getting from map information and successful missions can go a long, long way into funding a campaign. Uh, uh, I expect to take runs pretty quickly, so they won't be uh, too long in the field. Yes, my lord. Just taking Bedelli into Italy to get some trade rights with Venetians and Milanese and other Italian type people. Do -do 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 -do. Okay, one more turn. Ah! The, the nobles are speaking again. They seem to point, poke their nose into a lot of my business. Uh, they now want to take Rons capture and we will... Ah! You will send me some more units. <laughs> maybe they're giving me a hint that maybe I've just not got quite a big enough army. Maybe they have a boatload of peasants that they are training up and using instead of money. I don't know. And here comes Ingrid. Strange name for a Danish woman. I don't know. I think so. I've never heard of a Danish woman called Ingrid. And then again, I've never heard of a Danish woman at all. My lord, orders. Yes. Ah, one more turn. Maybe one more archer, just to be doubly sure. We do have the funds. Yes, your highness. London, build some mines. I need some more money. And York, you can't build anything. Get your act together, man. Have some more babies. Let's have this population increase to 800. Come on, get working. Half an acre's land to anybody that has a baby. Right, before we end the turn, well, 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 there. can't get my words out. We'll just take him along. Your orders, sire. Very quickly. If only okay. I could. Sire. I'm going to end the video on this part. As you wish. Uh, now, because the next part, I am actually going to fight the Battle of Carnarvon, mainly because I think. Hail my king! Welsh longbows in a castle will actually be quite tough for the army. Uh, if I auto generate it, I think it might be pretty close. So I'm going to actually fight this one, and in the next part, uh, you'll see some uh, the first hint of battle. So join me then.